Government last month announced that they had struck a deal to utilize the Clico building on Young Street, St. George's, through a lease agreement to house a number of courts. The plan, government says, is to utilize the building for a couple of years to house four courts, two civil and two criminal. Legal Affairs Minister Kendra Mather and Stewart says an agreement between government and Clico through its judicial managers is being finalized. At present, the parties are engaged in further discussions to basically finalize the logistics in terms of making that plant, that, that building um, available and suitable for accommodating the four courts. I would want to say that so far we have kept the bar um, fully informed as to the progress made and we will continue to keep the bar so informed as we progress. She says they are working to have the building fully commissioned for September 2019, the opening of the new law year. At the moment, court facilities have been interrupted. The minister admitted that there have been some inconveniences. All of the existing court facilities um, are operating, are ongoing. Of course, um, we would have some challenges with respect to um, the backlogs. And um, once we have our, our court plant um, up and running, then um, we may have to think about bringing in additional judges. Um, there is even talk and discussion of having a resident uh, master here to deal with some of the backlog. So these are things that we will put in place once we have um, our court plant up, running, and fully functional. The Grenada Bar Association has been calling for government to address the status of plans for a Halls of Justice project. The idea was first introduced 10 years ago under the former NDC administration. There is a committee in place, and that committee is currently working on, of course, the initial work to be done. Um, they, they, I know that they meet quite regularly, and very soon an announcement will be made with respect to our halls of justice. But that is um, government's priority at this time. Of course, we have to find an interim solution, and this is um, why we would have gone ahead and, 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 and started the work with respect to CLECO building. But the long-term solution to this problem is to have our halls of justice. And we have started the process. As a matter of fact, this process has started quite a while now. Um, it has intensified a little bit lately, and so we are, are very confident that very soon a great and big announcement will be made with respect to our halls of justice. Last month, the local bar association staged a brief protest on the grounds of the Supreme Court registry to express concern over government's failure to keep its promise to provide proper court facilities by end of December 2018. The problems at the courts, the Grenada Bar says, ranged from rat and mold infestation to radiation concerns. Eugenia Peters, GBN News.